who says you can't be productive on your phone well 3cx has an app that you can use right now that lets you receive calls forward calls put on hold chat and do a whole lot more with it so let me show you what i'm talking about right now Hey, what's up everyone? My name is George and this is 3CX. And if you don't know what 3CX can do, I'll be leaving the link in the description where I show you a quick overview of everything that it can do. Now, in this case, we're gonna talk about the 3CX app that's available for Android and iOS. In this case, I already have it here on my phone and I can receive calls, I can transfer calls, I can put on hold, I can schedule, I can chat, and I can do a whole lot with it. So I'm gonna show you what it can do. Now, first of all, 3CX is an enterprise phone system. That means that it has a whole lot of features. Now, you will be surprised that they do have a free plan that you can use right now, and it's a free forever plan. And they have small business, professional and enterprise plans that are also affordable. If you ask me, $195 built per year is actually really affordable. So do consider using 3CX because it has a ton of features. So in this case, this is a secondary account that I've just opened where I'm going to make a call to my phone to show you everything that it can do. OK, so let me call myself with the test account. So I'm going to start off account here. Boom, receiving the call here, going to answer. Here we go. Hello. Hello. Let me go ahead and mute it over here so we don't hear two voices. But in this case, I'm talking and you can hear it here on my phone. So it's working flawlessly. All right. So in this case, I can start a new call from here. I can go to conference. And if I go to conference, it's going to put on hold someone that I have calling me. So in this case, let me show you. Let me. Put the volume there. Let's go to conference. All right, so we got that elevator music there going on. I can add someone here to the conference by just clicking on this plus button and adding someone else. In this case, I don't want to do that. It's just for testing purposes. So let's come back here. Okay, here we go. We're back on the call. I'm still muted here. You can still hear myself with me talking over here. Kind of strange, but you get the idea, right? We could also transfer the call right here. So in this case, if I want to transfer, I can go ahead and bind or attend. So it depends if I just want to bind and send it out or I want to attend this actual transfer that I'm going to make. So in this case, let's just say that I want to bind this call and I can go ahead and type in the number or the code that I have for the other users or team members and I can go ahead and send it out here. And that means I'm going to transfer it. And while that's happening, this person is on hold while I'm doing that. So that means I can be talking to someone. Hey, hold on. Give me a second. Let me transfer you to customer support or to human resources, etc. And I can do so here by just typing in here and we're good to go. Let me go ahead and cancel that out. There we go. We're back here. And now I also have the option to use the earpiece, go to the keypad, start a video. Let me go ahead and mute the microphone there so we don't have double. Right now, the camera is... Uh, hidden so you can't see me but right now i just started a video call with this person so it's super easy to do so let me go ahead and cancel this my bad i i hit the hang up button but you get the idea all right so let's come back over here go let me go ahead and mute it really quickly i also have the option to put on hold by clicking on this pause button so that means that i can hit pause and i can be checking someone so i could say hey hold on give me a second let me check something for you and you know what? I can check the list over here, maybe the prices, the discounts, etc. So like that. Oh, and come back to the call. Just like that. Super easy, right? And that's for the calling features. So again, you have all these features too over here on your desktop app. So I can go ahead and hang it up from here or hang it up from my phone. So that's for the calling features. I really love the feature where you can transfer calls, which is super useful and super professional. And the pause button with music on the background. Now, what else can we do? Well, I can view my team members here. All my team members are going to be listed here, so I can go ahead and call them really quickly. I have my contacts, which I'm not going to show because personal data, the keyboard to type in a call, my recent calls, my chat. So if I want to chat with someone, so if I want to chat with Johnny right now, I want to say hello. I can do so really easy straight from my app, right? You can see over here popped up. I can reply from here, I can ignore it, or I can go to the chat section. So in this case, here's the chat section where I can go ahead and reply also, and I'll just say hello too, and I'll receive it over here on my phone. Just as easy as that, all right? Let me head on out of here. I give you my voicemail in case I have voicemails. I can go to my settings. I can schedule, for example, if I wanna make a meeting right here, I can do so by doing my adding my date here, the time, the pin for this particular meeting. Is it gonna be video or just call? add to calendar, add 3CS contacts from here, and 
send out this scheduled meeting. Super easy, right? Also the settings, we can also view the meetings that we have available here. In this case, I don't have one, but you can view them here. Your settings, you can silence this. You can keep it active so it doesn't go to the background. I can scan the QR code. So it's just as easy as that. For example, if I open up my 3CX account, I can scan the QR code and it's going to be tied to my phone. So no need for logging in, just scanning right there. And it's just as easy as that. And for settings, you have several settings for your account, your advanced, your application theme, your reprovision and recent credentials in case you need it. So all that is going to be available in your mobile app that's available for Android and iOS. So as I mentioned before, it's a next gen enterprise phone system to start using right now in your company. And plus, you can't say no to the free version in case you're a small company right now with less than 10 users. You're definitely good to go if you have less than 10 users. You're going to get access to all of this in the free version. If you need more features, jump into the paid plans. And there's also a hosted version. So a lot of options available with 3CX. I think it's a really great company that you can start using right now and implement it in your business. So if you're using it right now, don't forget to download the app on your phone so you can start using it right away so you can still be productive while not being at your desktop. And that's a wrap for 3CX.